and welcome. In this video tutorial, we're going to show you how you can use Streetwise to send paging messages to your personnel or their devices using a simple interface in the uh, administrative web portal. The first thing to understand is there are two types of messages that you can send using the paging feature within Streetwise. The first is a push notification. Now, we're all familiar with push notifications. They're messages that go to a user's telephone, regardless of whether or not that user happens to have your application open at any given moment. Now, push notifications are governed by whatever settings that individual has for push notifications on their telephone. The second type of paging message is an in-app streetwise device message. Those are sent to the application itself and will appear only when the application is running and will appear as a drop-down text box within the application itself. Push notifications are best used for notifying or sending messages to your individual responders on their smartphones, whereas device messages are useful when trying to send messages to an MDT or a tablet that's running streetwise in the truck. First, let me demonstrate how you send a paging message to just one or two devices. If you're going to send a message to a responder, open the Responder tab in the Client Administrative Web Portal and scroll down until you find the person that you want to send the message to. Let's say in this case we're going to send it to Firefighter Babcock. Check the box to the left-hand side of his name, then scroll back up to the top of that tab and look for the button that says Page Devices. When you click that, it'll open up dialog that allows you to enter the message that you want to send. In this case, we're going to just send a test message. Once you've entered the message, determine whether you want to send a push notification message only or an in-app message that'll appear as a drop-down within the application itself. We're just going to send a push notification because that's the most common thing that you would do. Then once you've done that, simply click OK and the message will be sent. The same thing can be done with an MDT simply by repeating that procedure using the MDT tab instead of the Responder tab. Well, what about when you want to send a message to a predefined group of individuals, such as your department officers or your hazmat team or your arson investigators? For that reason, we've created a feature called Paging Groups. Paging Groups allow you to develop a predefined list of individuals to whom the message will be sent so that you can send a message to all those individuals simultaneously at one click of the button. Now, to, to create a paging group, first depart, put your department into edit mode in the administrative web portal. Then look for the tab called Paging Groups. Once you're there, click the New button, give your paging group a name, for instance, Maintenance Officers. Then use the Link button and the Search field to identify the individuals that you would like included in that group. For instance, let's open our group of responders and we'll identify three or four people that we would like added to this group. Once you've done that, you hit OK and then you've created your paging group. That group can then be used over and over again because it appears in the paging group tab. To send a message to that paging group, you'll use the same procedure you did for sending a message to individuals. Identify the group that you want to send the message to, use the Page Devices button, create your message, and then use the OK button to send that message. Now remember, when you create a paging group, that paging group will be available to be used by any member of your department that has access to your administrative client web portal. It's not necessary for each individual to create their own groups. One time, and it's good for everyone. Also, if your department is part of a region, you'll notice that in the My Region menu, there's also a tab for paging groups. Paging groups can be set up at the regional level and can include members 
across multiple departments so that you can page members from multiple departments all at the same time just at the push of a button.